You've done a decent job so far. Come back to the Coon Lair. I think we should advance your character. Coon out! You've done a decent job so far. Come back to the Coon Lair. I think we should advance your character. Coon, out! You are a minor approaching an area with controlled substances. Step away from the door or you will be terminated. Rockford Files? Ooh, I mean me. Remember Lawrence Welk? Ah, oh, yeah, I remember. Moon River is my favorite. Careful who you chat with, sweetie. Folks here will bend your ear about their medications and buffets. <laughs> I just know them nurses are swiping my casino nickels. Of course, I got my metformin first thing for my diabetes, and then the three blood pressure pills every two hours, or uh, maybe it's two pills every three hours. Ah, it evens out. I got about ten minutes until my next pill, kid. Let's do a picture. Woohoo! Woohoo, alrighty. I'll have a nurse help me find you on the CompuSave. Guess my age, kiddo. People say I don't look a day over 97. My little grandkid never visits, so you'll have to do. It's picture time! <laughs> Thanks, kiddo. I'll look for you on the rec center's AOL. Fine. Please. Just like the rest. Now, did I forget my doxazosin today? Oh, yep, diapers.
My parents were out partying until 3 a.m. last night. WTF? Okay, you're approaching the hideout. Find a way in, but be careful. He's probably armed to the teeth. Thermal imaging is showing the suspect is in the rear of the house. You should have him in sight. Hey, who are you? What are you doing in my house? Engage! Engage! I don't know what you're doing in my house. Stand your ground. Gah, what the hell do you want with me? Get the hell out of my house, goddammit. Return fire. Ah. What's wrong with you? That'll teach you to corrupt our Look, youth I'm with I'm just drugs. defending my castle. One less violent degenerate this town has to deal with. Please come by and help us again. Turd, your follower count is way too low. I gotta protect. New kid, come, take a seat. All right, well, how's it going out there? Okay, good talk. Uh, well, listen, I think you show some potential, and uh, I'm going to upgrade you to somebody's sidekick or something. Congratulations. I just maybe wanted to talk about your superhero character a little bit. Um, your character sucks, to be honest, and I think I'm going to let you dual class. Let's pick another ability to add. So what kind of skill set are you looking to add to your repertoire? Elementalist. Cyborg. Psychic. Elementalist. Blaster. Speedster. Elementalist. Ah, Elementalist. With power over, you know, the earth and stuff.
Okay, I think those two will work nicely together. But now we're gonna need to change your backstory, too. So let's go back again to that fateful night. Back when you were little. You did lay awake that night. But the reason you couldn't sleep was because you wanted to make the world a safer place. You walked to the mirror. You looked in the mirror and wondered if anyone would ever love you. And then you heard a noise, but, but it was a baby crying. Out in the hallway, you saw two guys attacking a helpless baby on the floor. You had to stop them from hurting that baby, didn't you? You knew you had the power to stop them, and so you called upon your newly discovered power! You had to stop these thugs in their traps. You started by entrapping the biggest in an ice prison! by the cold, the intruder could only watch as it turned past him back. Hey, you can't just take a man's turn like that. Yeah, who do you think you are, kid? The intruders approached you, though little did they know they had set themselves up perfectly for a sand trap. I think this kid has some kind of power over ice and earth. Impossible. You took the opportunity to heal and focus your powers. I think I'll move over here. Oh man, I finally get a whack this damn kid! Feeling focused, you shrugged off the blow and readied your ultimate attack. Summoning the powers of ice, water, lightning, and earth, you unleashed into the intruders an elemental onslaught! Anyway. And so you beat them. You swept the baby up in your arms to take him somewhere safe, and then that's when the unthinkable happened. You saw your dad. Fuck your mom. And from then on, you had to live with the fact that because you were busy helping a baby, you couldn't stop your mom from being fucked by your dad. That's heavy, man. I'm really sorry. I know you probably want to know why. Why your dad fucked your mom, but those are answers you'll have to find for yourself. Cooning friends alert! Cooning friends alert! Seriously guys, alert! Alert! The Cooning friends alert! This is Coon, what's happening? It's the Freedom Pal! What have they done now? Just get to Main Street, hurry! We're coming! Coon! Ow! Well, new kid, looks like you might be needing those newfound powers. Follow me! <laughs> <laughs> 